morning guys, so I have definitely literally woken up like this. I probably still have like crust in my eye and potential dribble around my mouth, but um, thank god my camera's not fully HD, eh? Um, so yeah, today it is Monday. I don't know if I vlogged that much yesterday. I think I did vlog, but I think I may have just deleted the footage, so maybe there wasn't a yesterday in the vlog. Um, but either way, yesterday was boring. Today is probably still gonna be quite boring. I am just going to be doing a lot of work. Um, Ollie gave me a coffee before his driving lesson. Mondays are now officially my favorite day because Ollie goes to a driving lesson and gets me a coffee on the way back. Um, so yeah, today I'm just gonna be doing some work. I might go out to a cafe. Um, there are loads of things I have to do. I literally really want to get it all done so that I can start my gaming channel. Hey guys, so I finally managed to get my work done. I had to do like a last minute thing, so it's now like half four. I have to run to the lizard shop before they shut. And I'm covered in fake tan, so I'm probably stinking like biscuits. Um, but yeah, I think I'm gonna go to the coffee shop, maybe get some really late lunch slash dinner. Um, hopefully they have something left, otherwise I'll just end up with cake. So I just got in, again, way out of breath. I really want this like chest infection to go. Um, I think I probably need to hoover. I don't know if you can see behind me, but the cats have kicked all of their cat litter around. So I probably need to get onto doing that. So yeah, I went and had coffee, as you saw. And then I felt a bit awkward, so I had to leave because there were three men opposite in like the Indian takeaway shop who kept waving at me and blowing kisses. And guys, just a heads up, if you want to get hold of women, like if you want to get them to come into your shop or be your girlfriend or whatever, don't blow kisses at them from a curry shop. Not the most attractive thing to do, so I left there pretty quick. Yes, yeah, so I'm just gonna run a hoover around the house or something, and then I'm probably just gonna go and get some food. Nothing really interesting. Oh, hey guys, so my camera's flashing. Like the battery, and I don't know why, because I've had it on charge for ages. I don't know, but I thought I'd just show you what I'm wearing quickly. It's really boring. Um, basically, I'm wearing the same dress that I was wearing earlier, but I've just tucked it in a little bit because it's too cold to wear a dress now. Um, my jacket's from ARK, my dress is from Next, jeans are Neen Bing that are way too tight for me and I've literally had to just squeeze myself into them because of my fake tan. And then my shoes are from Bershka, hats from Bershka as well. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to go out to the supermarket and get some food because again, we have nothing to eat. Hey team, I thought I'd do a bit of a grocery haul because I like doing these kind of things. I got some frozen beans, some chia seeds, got some brown rice that was only a bloody quid. So I got all of that for about £23 I think, which I don't think is half bad. What are you doing down there Michael? Okay yeah, attack my bag, thanks. I'm ill. Bed now, guys. It's late, and I need to sleep. Hey guys, so it is what day are we on? Tuesday today. Um, I think it's now like midday. I've been up since about nine o'clock in the morning, but I literally haven't been able to move because um, obviously last night I took all of those like, vitamins and stuff, um, and they were fine, like to have together. I obviously, check that beforehand. Um, but I think like the actual coating of the tablets combined and they basically gave me chronic gas. So I have been in bed all day. I've literally only just started feeling better. I had to have a doctor out. I nearly went to the hospital because I literally couldn't move. Um, like my stomach had like quadrupled in size just because it was just filled with gas and we thought there was something really wrong with me. Um, but I've just burped a lot and I feel that it's better, which makes me feel really pathetic. Um, I'm meant to be going to London tonight, well, tomorrow morning, but I have to travel up tonight. Um, and I do really want to go because obviously I've got like meetings and stuff like that. 
Um, so I'm just going to try and keep on burping just to make myself feel better. Ollie's gone out to get me um, like some charcoal tablet things as well as some mints and yeah then I just think I'm gonna try and do some work um, I don't know how pathetic is that I feel so embarrassed I had to have a doctor come over and I was just sat like because I was in bed wearing the same thing that I went to sleep in which was like a crop top and pants and that was it and he saw me like that and he was touching my stomach and had to go up my top and I was just there like great way to start a Tuesday so yeah I am feeling a lot better now though but oh that was scary how are you feeling? hello how's that? vegetables you look great thanks so hello it's now 22 11 um, I literally haven't done anything today, like, apart from just work and, well, I didn't have that exciting time with me getting the doctor over because I had gas, so I'm now all stocked up on, like, Rennies and that sort of thing, so <laughs> no worries there. Um, yeah, it was really embarrassing, he literally came over, felt my stomach and was like, don't know what it is, and then he left. I burped about 400 times and then I felt great again, so that's about all the exciting thing that's happened in my day. Um, I have just uploaded a new post, a new Tip Tuesday, so check that out if you do enjoy my Tip Tuesdays. Sorry about this mess, Ollie's decided to dump some of his work stuff on here and I shifted my computer over last night so we could watch a film. Um, what did we watch? We watched Southpaw with Jake Gyllenhaal and it was quite good. Um, I was going to say it's really good but to be honest I just like most films really but um, yeah, it was okay. And yeah, so later on I need to drive up to Plymouth because I can't get a train this time around because it's too late because Cornwall's so behind, there are like no late trains. So I have to get a coach, which is loads of fun. Um, that's going to be like six hours travel, so I'll try and film anything that I can to make that look interesting. Um, but yeah, I get into uh, London at like nine, and I've got a meeting at 10 and then I'm getting my hair done at 1 so not much to do in the day but it'll all add up because I've got to go to like the other side of London to get my hair done um, but I might also do some shopping I want to go into Blow in Covent Garden or at least I think it's in Covent Garden I've been trying to do some research but I know there's one in Canary Wharf I'm getting a dead arm um, but that's a bit way out so I'm going to try to go to the one in Covent Garden which is around the corner from where I'm going to get my hair done and I want to get the Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade. Um, I just need to figure out what colour I'm going to be. Uh, but yeah. So how would you like a sexy outfit of the day? Um, I look so ill, even though I actually feel a lot better now. But yeah, today guys, my outfit consists of Hey Pepe, number one fan. I'm wearing Ollie's Salt Rock hoodie that fits absolutely perfectly. I am wearing H&M joggers and if we roll up my legs a little bit oh no they disappeared well well now I've just made this outfit look even better um, but I am wearing leggings underneath underneath this as well and then I don't really know what else I'm wearing I'm just gonna keep this like that maybe I'll put on Ollie's shoes I have been very naughty and I've eaten lots of sweets okay so for today's look I've decided to complete my outfit with a pair of size 10 men's shoes how do they look? I'm a trend I was going to say trend lead yeah I'm a trend leader not a trend follower stop judging me Guys, you know the drill with this. Sorry about the mess, but I just thought I would show you what I'm wearing before I leave because I probably won't get a chance to show you. Um, I'm just wearing, well, I think this is what I'm wearing. I'll probably change my mind last minute, but right now I'm wearing a blazer from Zara, I think. T-shirt is actually from Tesco and they make like the best v-necks and they're so comfy and floppy and just, oh, best things ever. 
Trezors are from Bershka, my old favourites. I've actually got a rip in the crotch, or ever so slight. Um, that looks dodgy. So, anyway, yeah, and I'm also wearing my Nikes. I have no idea what Nikes they are, but they're comfy as hell. And last time I was in London, I wore, like, knee-high boots, and it wasn't the comfiest thing in the world. Um, so, yeah, I've opted for trainers today. Hey, Pepe. He's always in the back of my vlogs. Yeah, I'm probably going to have to head off in a minute. I might stop at Tesco beforehand and get some sort of sandwich. Hey guys, so I just got into London. It is Wednesday today, is it Wednesday? I don't know, my brain's all like, all over the place. Um, but yeah, I'm just heading to the underground now and then I can go to Moorgate where I've got my first meeting. Um, but yeah, my voice is all husky because I haven't actually um, said anything today. It's been like an eight hour journey. But yeah, I think I've got like 40 minutes to get there, so I better run. Oops. So guys, I don't mean to brag, but this is perhaps my best hairstyle to date. What do you think? I just think it's really innovative because you know you've got like the natural side, then you've got the high tech metallics, and then I've got the bun at the back, so it's like the hun, like what Courtney Kardashian's doing. Is it Courtney or Chloe? I never really know. But what someone in that family's doing, I think it's a great look. I think I'm ready to leave. A star, done. Hey guys, so I haven't vlogged in a while. Um, yeah, so basically, got my hair done and now it's probably dark so you can't see me um yeah I just feel really ill now um I don't know I guess it's just all caught up on me so I'm going to go to sleep I'll probably show you my hair properly when I get in because I think last time you saw it it was literally like in tinfoil which probably wasn't the best look um I'm out of breath because I just ate like four packs of cocktail sausages in literally about two minutes so that's all I have to update you on Good morning guys it is 11 o'clock and I am so bunged up um, do not go in that space so basically, I was maybe in uni like two hours ago, but I sort of knew that I wasn't going to like be there on time. I ideally wanted to be there at about 10, but hey ho, I need to go to Tesco, go to the post office, and then I will be on my way. Oh, something benefit. What is this? Ooh. A lash primer and mascara from day to night. I'll look at that more when I get home. But it's good though. I'm running out of my favourite mascaras. Okay, I know what this is. This is a very nice top from this pack. Something that I can try and get my hands on for ages. Glad it It's one of those, um, Cool. Like crossbody bodies, basically. You know, it's one of them. What are you? Oh, I know what it's gonna be. It's gonna be stuff for the body shop because I'm gonna be working with them soon. I have got the Wonder Blur. The what are you? Bouncy sleeping mask. 
that sounds fun anything to do with sleep and the drops of youth concentrate i've got the eye concentrate actually already at home oh have they given that to me as well yeah so i've got that as well so i've got a new one that is great there's another nail put that in my pocket for later oh right on to home again fuck my life i won't be parking here again then naughty stuff naughty naughty stuff right where are these little rascals parked i think i'm going out for a coffee with hannah and nikki Well, that was a nice little impromptu trip. I think I've got some sand on my lens. Yeah, so I don't know if you possibly saw them, but that's Hannah and Nikki, who are like my two best uni friends. I didn't eat the banana from this morning. Um, so yeah, it was good to get out and just be able to chill out and not really think about too much. Um, I think that like, the one good thing, or like, there's a few good things, but like the main good thing about me vlogging is the fact that I kind of want to make things look more interesting so I am like more inclined to go and do interesting things which means that I'm more inclined to go out and just do things that actually look good on camera that I probably actually need to do for myself but I never really do. Ah there they are, little snakes. Hello everyone, so sorry to end the vlog yesterday, nothing really happened though, didn't miss out on much. Um, just got uni again today. It's now 8.54 in the morning, um, I should be in my lecture at 9 and I will be 10 minutes late but that's better than my 4 hours yesterday. Um, not really doing anything today purely because my lecture is about 7 hours long. Um, so yeah, I won't be doing anything overly interesting but we will see what happens. Hello everyone, so it is Saturday today and it's about three o'clock in the afternoon and Ollie's waving a sausage at me. Not that kind of sausage. Do you want to be in it? No. <laughs> um, and it's about three o'clock and we've just gotten up. We've been awake since about 11-ish. Um, Ollie has somehow hurt his back so I'm literally having to do everything like put his socks on, put his jeans on, but making he's making sausages so he can do that. Um, but yeah, today is very, very boring. Sorry I didn't really vlog yesterday or much the day before. To be honest, it's supposed to be really like, boring days. And now there's gonna be sizzling everywhere. Um, yeah, I'm gonna try and make today a bit more interesting. But I do need to tidy, so that's not gonna be that interesting. Do you wanna be more noisy, mate? Also thought I'd just show you some of the things that I picked up the other day that I didn't really get to show you. Um, this is the Jimmy Choo Illicit perfume that I'm giving away on my blog. Um, can't remember when the giveaway ends, but if it's still running by the time you see this, I will let you know. Um, and then I got the benefit package, which is, what are you? The new They're Real Tinted Primer. So tints, defines, and um, primes. I guess it's like a natural look and then you add the actual they real and it makes your lashes crazy and they also sent me another they real which I've run out of so that's good. From the body shop I got their Drops of Youth collection. I got this sleep balm which let me try and open it one second. So it looks like this, I don't know if you guys can see it but it's like a gel formulation almost. And it's really, really weird if you sort of touch it lightly. Let me see if you can see it. Like, it sort of dents it. Can you see that? Like if I, I don't know, you probably can't see that. It's like a really weird consistency and it smells so nice as well. 
Also got the drops of Youth Concentrate. And my camera's running out of battery again. So that's just, I don't know, I guess it's just like a serum type thing. Um, got the eye serum, which I've had before, which is just like a rollable. Come on. So it just looks like that. I've still got some left of my old one, but um, I really like this. It's good for waking you up. And then, come on, we have got the Wonder Blur. So it's like a primer, maybe. I don't think it does any like moisturising or anything. But yeah, so I got that as well. So we're doing a video featuring all of these soon. And then I've got all of this uni work to go through. Wah, wah, wah. Hey team. So, for once in my life, I have eyeliner on. And I kind of think I'm into it. Excuse the rest of my face because I basically just have BB cream on, nothing else. But I have been looking at a lot of things on Pinterest and Instagram. And I've decided that my eyes are too round. I want longer eyes. And I'm not sure there's a way that I can actually stretch my eyes. So I'm going to try and actually learn how to do makeup for once. Um, same with contouring. I need to actually use my contour palette. Um, so yeah, I've decided to look into it. Have I got a stain on my shirt? Yeah, I've got a stain on my shirt. Bollocks. But yeah, I'm going to try and use this line to elongate my eyes. And make myself look more like Angie and Jolie. I think I'm nearly there. I think we're like spitting image now. Hang on. I don't think I've actually shown you guys my hair, really. Like not properly since I got it done. So the lighting is really bad here. I'm trying to figure out a way that I can show you. But um, yeah, so it's not blonde. We got there and we thought, my hair's very, very warm toned, so it wouldn't look right blonde. Like, this is the blondest part, and if you look at me, hang on, <laughs> this is a really good haircut. We decided, like, if I had blonde hair, I'd just look stupid. So, what we've gone for is a more intense version of what I had last time. Um, I don't know if you guys will be able to see it properly. Probably better if I do show it in, like, natural light at some point. There will be, like, a blog post coming up on my blog, um, probably soonish where I'll be reviewing the salon. You can see Michael and Pepe sleeping. I love you. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd just show you my hair, kind of. I'm getting used to length. The length doesn't bother me now whatsoever. And I really like the colour of it. Obviously I haven't done anything to it, because it's like Saturday and I don't do anything to my hair on most days, let alone on the weekend. Um, but yeah, hope you like it. I like that it's like a lot more blondy. Then before, I was looking through my old videos and I saw how dark I was, I mean, this is all my natural colour still, um, but it was just weird looking at pictures of myself where it was all dark, just like through and through. Um, but yeah, I like that it just looks a bit more blonde and a bit more interesting, because when I had my hair cut off, most of the ballet I just cut off, and now this kind of just goes up a bit higher, and I've got one really blonde bit that I'm obsessed with. This is, this is like my blonde bit. Can you guys see that? This is like, I can consider myself a blonde because I've got this blonde bit in my hair. You guys are going to have to excuse the mattress still sitting in our um, landing. But I want to do a sort out of all of my beauty products. This isn't even makeup, it's just like skincare, hair stuff. And that's it. So let me know if you want me to film me kind of sorting it out, whether I should do it in like a vlog or like a standard video. Um, but yeah, there's a lot to sort out and it's kind of like, makeup's not really my thing. Um, so doing like a makeup collection isn't the most interesting thing that I could probably do. But um, skincare is more like my forte, so that might be something fun to do. So it's now nearly 5 in the morning. It's nearly 5 in the morning, isn't it? Yeah, it's 4.30. 4.30 in the morning. And um, I've done nothing today, apart from being a good housewife. Isn't that right? No. Um, but yeah, I was all ready to go into bed, and then I decided to start jabbing my head with one of those blackhead extractors because he saw like a tiny blackhead, and now I've got dents all over my head. So, if I get spots, you're a dead man. Oh, yeah. Don't film me. <laughs>
<laughs> I don't want that. Okay, if I get spots, then you have to do something in a vlog. I'll tell you to fuck off in a vlog about that. Oh, I can't say that. What are you listening to There's now? There's a video of a gorilla with kittens. Good night, Might everyone. Full screen. Full screen unavailable. We'll find out more. I want to find. Good night. Baby gorilla's allowed to come by. Baby gorilla's allowed <laughs> so to come you by. <laughs> I'm going to sleep now. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>